Well, hi, Layla. How's it going? Good. I'm doing all right. Just got done shooting the board filming you. Yep, yep. Fun as always. It, it's been too long. I think it's been three and a half years. Yes, it has. It's been a long time. <laughs> yeah, we live pretty far apart, so it's not always easy to meet up at the same time. Yeah, but, but only four hours away, so that's yeah, good. Yeah, yeah. But uh, anyway, glad you're here. Thank um, you. Just tell us a, a bit about your yourself and your and your modeling, and I guess maybe in general, and then maybe fetish specifically. Okay, so um, I started modeling when I was seventeen. I am now twenty five, so it's been a while. Um, I started shooting fetish when I was probably, I think, twenty one. That's when I really, well, yeah, about twenty twenty one. So about four years ago, five, depending. I really don't know. <laughs> no, no, no. At least three and a half. <laughs> About three and a half. So um, I also do photography, but vor fetish are the only one that I've ever shot vor fetish with. But I've done feet fetish, burp fetish, balloon popping fetish, cigarette smoking fetish, and I don't even smoke cigarettes. <laughs> um, and then the giantess fetish. Yeah, I heard about that. I yes. I have done a little of it myself. Um, when I I sort of, when I did it, it was sort of like a challenge to myself. Like, could I, can I do this? Yeah. And then when I actually did it, I was kind of like, oh, this is kind of hot. It's actually pretty fun, too. <laughs> but me, I don't think I really have a fetish. Um, Here, I don't know. Here's a question, because um, I've heard... And maybe it's just the ones I've asked, but I, I feel like I've I've had this conversation with with a fair number of women now, mm -hmm. and um, it's I usually ask it of of models, but sometimes just people I'm dating. But I've I've heard that a lot. Like women don't have fetishes that often. Like fixations. Like they yeah. they like a strong man or a strong yeah. woman if they if they're that way. I get but... that when girls are like, oh, well, my fetish is tattoos. I'm like, that's not a fetish. That's just what you like. An yeah, of somebody. it's like having a boob fetish. It's like, doesn't everybody though? Is it a fetish anymore when it's too common? I I know. I don't know. It could be one of those things where fetish turns into a popular thing now, and then everybody starts having fetishes. Yeah. But I've noticed that a lot of half more than, a little more than a quarter of my fans watch a lot of my fetish videos. But me in general, I really don't have a fetish. I don't think. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah, I, I have a friend who um, was thinking about doing uh, butt modeling for Instagram, you know, just, just to try to get some, mm. and I'm sure, I'm sure you've got some experience with that, and she was constantly asking me, because I mean, I'm not, I'm not really an expert on that, but um, she yeah. was asking me, um, you know, should I do this, should I do that, what do you think of this, what do you think of that, and I'm like, with my own stuff, it's like, this actually is a thing for me, and yeah. so... It, that helps clarify my focus. Like, mm -hmm. I, I know what feels good and I know what doesn't. And so I'll focus on what feels good to me. And so I try to encourage her, like, some, find something about this that you like. You like. That, yeah, that mm -hmm. when you're ever in doubt, you can just sort of go back to that because it's, it's really who you are. Yep. So I don't know. Do you feel that way about what you do? Oh, with my butt? Anything, yeah. <laughs> yeah, butt or anything. You know, I don't know. I kind of also do a little bit of research, too, on what seems popular and what people are aiming to most but you're lucky because I mean you know what you're doing and if you like it you know damn well that they're gonna like it but if you don't like it most likely they're probably not gonna like it but then there's some people mm. who not always you know a few of my movies I I'm not that proud of either because yeah. I accepted a commission that I so I think I told you before, like, when I was doing my early commissions, I was, like, sort of just doing whatever I could to yeah. make people happy. Some of those I wasn't too fond of, but they had a good reaction. Yeah. And then there were a couple where I was just lazy, honestly. I just <laughs> tried to shoot something in less than an hour, just get it, it in, with. get it out, and cut it together in less than an hour or two, and somehow it just takes off, and I'm like... Glad you like it. But then again, with your stuff, too, like when I'm getting eaten up, I mean, those feet fetish guys are loving, <laughs> you know, my shoes coming off, close-ups of my toes, my feet, my feet wiggling. Yep. So if they don't have a vor fetish, then they have the feet fetish, and so, I mean, anything can really go through that. There's something for everyone. Butt fetish. I mean, hello, <laughs> my butt always shows in, <laughs> in these videos. Yeah, and, so. and mine's legs, and... um. I get people asking me, like, how come the models never wear jeans? And you're, I'm like, well, because then I can't see their legs. That's yeah. why they never wear jeans in my videos. <laughs> you know, sometimes, it's funny because I've gotten guys where they're like, I want you to wear jeans because your legs look amazing in jeans. And I'm like, 
I'm just been like a sausage and a sausage roll. Because, <laughs> like, I don't know. But, yeah. No, I love looks, too. Yeah. It's like, I love your eyes when they have sunglasses on them. It's like, yeah, uh, right. Thanks. Even though I can't see them. But, you know.